What is up, Hammerheads? Welcome back to The Forge. Today, I'm going to just do a quick update video on what's going to be happening over the next couple weeks. Uh, very big project we're going to be doing. Uh, big announcement. So stay tuned. guys so what's going to be happening over the next couple weeks uh first and foremost i will be at blade show uh june 3rd and 4th i think is that friday and saturday i will not be there on sunday because i have to get back for church but i will be there all day friday and saturday um we're booth 28x i do believe but if you find the knife shop and survival outpost banner we're right there close I'm set up with a good friend of mine, Michael Brown. He does Michael Brown custom knives. Absolutely beautiful knife maker. Yeah, I didn't call him beautiful. His knives are beautiful. Just want to, I had to stop and clarify that before I keep going. Uh, but I did want to just talk about also some videos that are going to be coming up over the next couple of weeks. Uh, the next video that will be coming up after this one is going to be a repurposed video turning these tongs into a punch holder for a punch. Let's see if I can get that closer. That I got from Buckeye Engraving. I bought this from them a couple weeks back and I'll talk more about it in the video. But after that video, there's gonna be some Blade, blade Show footage uh, pop up. Blade Show footage uh, will just be me walking around, kind of showing what all was there and talking to some people. I'm not really going to be talking to anyone that is like the big name companies. I really want to talk to the guys that are individuals set up like I am. It'll be kind of like a mini meet the maker. Uh, getting that sh started um, will also be coming up in the course of the next couple weeks too. Um, is going around meeting different blacksmiths. I thought Blade Show would be kind of a good kickoff for that. So there'll just be many things. Me like just saying, hey, who are you? What, you, what do you do? So that'll also be popping up. And I just, I really wanted to show the, the, the skill and all these great knife makers and blacksmiths that are gonna be there showing off their work. Um, just to kind of give them prompts. A lot of times they don't get hit up with a lot of videos on, you know, because it's normally like the big, big, big companies that people talk to. Um, also, the next demonstration on how-to videos will be knife making Ooh, don't fall you will need to go ahead and get a piece or get a file of whatever size you want to get this one's just an old one I had laying around the shop and I've already annealed it and a piece of your spring steel now we're gonna be doing these videos um, in very 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 detail there's going to be a ton of detail in these because I want everyone to see every step of the process on making the knife. So one knife is, I know for a fact, is going to have handles and everything, um, pins, everything's going to be set up in it. Um, and it's going to be, you know, start to finish completed knife. One of them will be, sorry, I got something wrong, I guess. Uh, one of them is going to be, um, might be a wraparound handle or we might do just, you know, scales and everything on it. I don't know. Uh, haven't made it that far. Uh, the round bar one is going to be a lot of focusing on start and finish turning round bar into flat bar and then forging the knife out of it. We're not probably going to go into a ton of detail of the grind and everything because we're going to be focusing on that in this video with the file. The file will be the first video. Um, but you will need to anneal them. If you don't know what annealing is, is you heat your metal up to critical heat, meaning a magnet won't stick to it anymore. And you're gonna put it in either sand or leave it in like a gas forge and let it cool down slowly. And you're probably gonna wanna do this a couple times. If you put it in sand, it takes like a day or so for it to fully cool down. Because with annealing, when it's the slower the material cools down, the softer it will be. And you need your file to be extremely soft. Um, we are also gonna be making a pair of tongs for the video. This will actually be the first video of the series is making the tongs and then we will be making, this will be the first knife that we make. Um, last, and this is kind of big news. During the series of these, 
and actually I'm going to do it regardless, but I am looking for us to hit 500 subscribers. Um, because when we do, I am going to do a giveaway. Well, if we hit 500 subscribers by the end of the knife making, all the knife making videos, like I said, which will take a couple weeks for all of this to be done. Um, I am going to be giving away one of the knives that we make with a sheath and everything with it. I'll let whoever wins choose which knife they want. Um, I'm also going to be giving a piece of 5160 spring steel flat bar cut to a length for a knife. Uh, handle scales, pins, um, maybe some of the other stuff. I don't know. This is that's the main things I know I'll be sending. I don't know. I've got to look at the regulations on like shipping epoxy uh, from like USPS and FedEx and stuff. If I can, then I will. If I can't, then I'll let you know on the day the winner's picked. And if anything else is going to be in the box. If we hit close to a thousand subscribers, I am going to give away the other knife, plus maybe a couple other things with that also. But you'll get, you know, all the knife making stuff with, the, you know, with the 500 subscriber plus a pair of the tongs. I forgot to say that. And I'll leave all this stuff linked, you know, uh, in the description so you can kind of be like, okay, this is what the giveaway is because John makes no sense. But all of that will be given away once I hit 500 subscribers. And I'm actually truly believing that after Blade Show and after this series of videos, we'll be over 500 subscribers. Um, stepping out in faith in this one. I uh, heard a guy speak once and he said, if you're going to believe, believe big. What's the point of believing little things? You know, you keep praying for a day and God will give you the year if you would ask for it. So I'm stepping out in faith, stepping out of the boat, as they say, and I'm believing that by the time the series is over with, we'll be over 500 subscribers. Um, if we are very close to 1,000 subscribers, then I will give away a second place uh, prize also. And it will be anybody that's already subscribed, anybody new that's subscribed, I'll be bundled in, and I'll do one of those generator things like they do with everybody's names. Sorry. So that is all the stuff that's happening over the course of the next couple weeks. Um, as I said, next video will be the repurposing video of these tongs and then some blade show footage and then we will be getting into knife making. So guys, uh, that's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you down at blade show, I hope. Come by, say hey, tell me that you're a hammerhead. Uh, look forward to shaking everybody's hand, give some hugs and all those great things. So I'll see you down at blade show or I'll see you on the next video, guys. God bless, keep hammering.